Hi guys, my name is Pauline. Welcome to my channel. Today let's talk about local variables. All in Scratch we call it also for this sprite only. What you need to know about local variables and why we need them. For example, we want a lot of enemies in the games. We want to create a playground like a tic-tac-toe and so on. We need to create clones. When we create clones of our sprite, usually we want them to know some information, some values, some numbers for each clone individually. Let's say an example. I have a clone of our cat sprite and I want that each cat knows their value, for example, the number in Q. So I can create a variable for all sprites. Okay, and when I start this clone, I just want them simply say the number. So what I expect to see uh, the cat will, would say number one, the second one, two, three, and so on. But what happened when I use regular number? It's all says the equal value. But if I create a value, let's call it local number for this sprite only and change everywhere. I run it and you see that my first cat say one, the second one two, three. So our cats know their numbers. That's how you can use local variables. Watch my videos and you will see how we make it in a practice in different games. Write in the comments if it was useful for you and you want more some short tutorials. See you next time. Bye.